A question that often comes up when purchasing a two-way radio is, how far can I expect my radius to reach? The answer isn't so simple. Each radio comes with a quoted maximum range. However, in reality, you often experience less than this due to a number of environmental factors, including terrain, weather conditions, electromagnetic interference, and obstructions. The range chart printed on the back of all packaging for Motorola Talk About radios can give you an idea of what you can expect in various conditions, but we can take a look at what has the greatest impact on improving range and call quality. Radio waves, like light waves, travel out in straight lines from the antenna. So in the same way the sun or a light bulb will cast a shadow, an obstacle like a building or a hill can cast a radio shadow. For example, if you're out skiing, someone on top of the mountain can talk to their friends both on the north face and the south face of that mountain. But the person on one side of the mountain would be blocked by the mountain from talking to the person on the other side. Transmitting between two points with no obstacles in the way is also limited due to the curvature of the earth. For two people standing with a radio six feet above the ground, the radio horizon over the Earth's curvature will result in a maximum range of about six and a half miles. The single most important factor affecting range, then, is the terrain over which you're trying to communicate. The most effective way to increase range is to get to a higher point above the ground. Something as simple as going from sitting to standing can increase your range about a mile. As this chart shows, the maximum range you're able to communicate rapidly increases as one or both of the radios get higher above their surrounding area. Moving from the ground floor of a building to the second floor extends the radio horizon from six and a half to almost 11 miles. Moving both radios to 100 foot tall hills extends the horizon to nearly 28 miles. Using a high power channel does not significantly extend the radio horizon. Higher power does help give you better coverage within the limit of that radio horizon. As you can see in this graphic, the area with good and moderate coverage is greater when the transmitting power is higher. This can help with the clarity of the call, but the maximum range remains about the same. Battery charge levels will have an effect similar to using a high or low power channel. The rechargeable battery pack is a slightly lower voltage than alkaline cells. Be sure your batteries are fully charged, or use alkaline batteries for the maximum coverage. Using the monitor feature in your talk about radio can help you with hearing people you might not normally be able to. Reception of weak signals will become intermittent and you'll begin to miss words. Activating monitor opens the radio receiver and even the weakest intermittent signals can be better understood. Be sure to check out our other how-to videos for help with the other features on your talk about two-way radios.